Good morning everybody. In previous video, we learned the symmetry and congruency. So, today exercise 8.2. So, exercise 8.2 before we learn some definitions. First one is the symmetry. Yeah. First observe this picture. Yeah. Two parts are same. Yeah. This is the line. Yeah. Upper part and down part are both are same. So, look at the following figures. If we fold them exactly, to their half halves one half each figure exactly consider with other half here suppose here fold here here exactly this half equal to another half so that is the symmetry the folding line is symmetry line here this is the b b letter here we draw the one horizontal line so here upper part and lower part both are exact same so this is the symmetry line symmetry this symmetry line we call line symmetry or mirror symmetry, reflection symmetry, mirror symmetry. We say anyone. Next, rotational symmetry. Rotational symmetry means here you observe these pictures. Here first, here this is the rectangle. Here we rotate the 180 degrees. So here that is the symmetry diagram. So here this is the square. So here square is the first we rotate the 90 degrees 90 degrees again the square is a symmetry so next rotate 90 degrees also symmetry so here any square here four symmetry lines are there here circle also here rotate first we rotate the picture rotating after also symmetry that is the symmetry rotational symmetry next point symmetry point symmetry means the figure looks the same either you see it from the upside or from downside from any two opposite directions is called a point symmetry here upside and downside is same any two opposite directions that is the point symmetry next tessellation is a another point so here usually these patterns are formed by arranged congruent figures or mirror images set by side in side by side in all the directions to spread upon the area without any overlaps and gaps without any overlaps and gaps gaps this is called a tessellation just like a floor arrangement is the best example tessellation means here floor arrangements in our house so here without gaps here without any overlaps or gaps that is the tessellation we arrange the um, uh, figures here or any items here we are arranging that uh, place here without any overlappings or gaps that is called a tessellation best example is the um, floor example in our house now we start the exercise 8.2 first one cut the bold type english alphabets capitals and paste in your notebook draw possible numbers of lines of symmetry for each of the letters here first one how many letters have no line of symmetry first we are we write all capital letters in english now i am already write the capital letters here and draw the symmetry lines also here first we write alphabets a to z and draw the symmetry lines here a a is the one vertical line symmetry line is there next b b also one horizontal line symmetry c d e also only horizontal line symmetry only line symmetry is there some letters are having rotational symmetry here h is the two symmetric lines are there here high is two symmetric lines here k is one m is one here o is o is four symmetric lines is there so this is the uh, rotational symmetry is there so next we write the next points answers here first one is the how many letters have no line of the symmetry here how many letters have no line of the symmetry here f g j l n q r s z these letters are no symmetric lines so we write the answer just we write the letters f g j l n p q r s z these letters are no line of symmetry no line of symmetry next question how many letters have one line of symmetry here how many letters are one line here a is one 
you are asking one line symmetry one line symmetry means here here a b c d e here h is also here two lines we draw the two line symmetries but here one line is the answer one line is the here one line symmetry is there here also one line symmetry is there here o is also one line symmetry is there here x x is also one line symmetry is there u v w x y these letters all are one line symmetry lines one line symmetry letters here one line you are asking one line symmetry one line symmetry letters are a b c d e h i k m m o t u v w x y these letters all are one line symmetric lines next we write that here yeah, third one how many letters have two line symmetry here yeah, how many letters are two line symmetries here yeah, one two two here yeah, wo wo is also two lines here yeah, two here yeah, x is also two line symmetry so we write h i o x are the h i o x are the four letters are two line symmetry is there four letters are two line symmetry next how many letters have more than two line symmetry here how many letters are more than two line symmetry here how many letters have more than two line symmetry here more than two line symmetry is the o x here o is the four symmetric lines x is a four symmetric line so these two letters are more than two symmetric lines so your answer is o comma x o comma x are the more than two line symmetric lines are there so next question fifth question is the which of them have rotational symmetry already we know the definition of rotational symmetry so now here here rotational symmetry here b here b is a rotational symmetry is there so why here b we rotate the 180 degrees here b is rotated 180 degrees so this is same symmetry line is there so next d also rotational symmetry is there next e is there h h is also rotational symmetry i i is also rotational symmetry we rotate the letter we rotate the letter symmetric line rotating after symmetric line divided the two parts of that letter that is the rotational symmetry so now here we write the letters here here fifth one is the which of the have rotational symmetry here b is the rotational symmetry d e is there h i m o s t w x z z these letters are rotational symmetry next sixth question which of them have point symmetry here point symmetry is the o is point point symmetry x h i e d these letters are point symmetry is there so this is the first bit answer next second question draw a line of symmetry for the following figures identify which of them have point symmetry is there any relation between line symmetry and point symmetry yeah. given some pictures are there here yeah, rectangle triangle square here yeah, pentagon hexagon here yeah. so these diagrams we draw the symmetry and line symmetry point symmetry so now your first your yeah, rectangle is there so now this rectangle we draw the symmetric lines here to one is the vertical line next another one is the horizontal line we draw these two lines these two are the symmetric lines of this rectangle so these two are the symmetric lines this is also rotating symmetry and horizontal symmetric lines line symmetry and rotation symmetry also there in this diagram next next diagram is the a triangle a triangle here we draw the three lines these three also line and rotating symmetric lines 
next third one is the square so square we draw the here these two are the symmetric lines now here diagonals also here symmetric lines so these lines are rotating symmetry and line symmetry lines so now here four symmetric lines are there in square next here pentagon here pentagon here we draw the five symmetric lines first one here two four next year five here five symmetric lines are we draw it here these lines are line symmetry and rotating symmetry lines same method we draw the remaining pictures also here hexagon hexagon we draw the eight symmetric lines So these lines are line symmetry and rotational symmetry lines. Same next, we draw the two diagrams also, same method. Yeah, join the one vertex and opposite side midpoint. Opposite side midpoint. So now here. same method we draw the all lines so these are all the symmetric lines here eight sides are there so we join the opposite sides we join opposite sides opposite vertices on sides suppose here next next vertices So these are the all symmetric lines. Next third question. Name some natural objectives whose faces have at least one line of symmetry. We observe the surroundings, image and write the examples here. Whose faces have at least one line symmetry. Our surroundings, we observe the surroundings here at least one line symmetric uh, line objectives we write the natural objectives suppose here moon moon is a circle shape that is a natural objective and symmetry line is there next orange orange fruit orange fruit is a symmetry line is there natural object butterfly so these all are the answers we write here some natural objectives here form the at least one symmetry line suppose here first one is the moon moon means here full moon full moon is a complete circle figure so we draw the symmetry line second one here face of a human being here any we dog face and human being face face of human being third one here orange next fourth here fourth butterfly 
फिफ्थ वन सनफ्लवर् सनफ्लवर् इज आलो इज ए रउंड शेप फ्लवर् सो वि डिवेड टू पार्ट सिमेट्रिक लाइन वि ड्रा द सिमेट्रिक लाइन दिस इज द थर्ड क्वेश्चन आंसर नेक्स्ट फोर्थ क्वेश्चन ड्रा थ्री टेसलेशन एंड नेम द बेसिक शेप्स यूज इन युवर टेसलेशन आलरे वि नो दिलेशन डेफिनेशन वि अरे सपोज इयर वि अरे द फ्लोर विथट ओवर लैप्स एंड गैप दट इज द टेसलेशन इयर टेसलेशन फॉर्मिंग टाइम वि यूज द शेप्स आलमोस्ट इयर रेक्टांगि पेटगा स्क्वेर ईक्युलेटरल ट्रयांगि हेक्सगा आलमोस्ट यूज दी शेप्स सो वि ड्रा सम शेप्स we use tessellation we use tessellation or pentagon rectangle square a square equilateral triangles and hexagon etc we use almost we use these shapes so we use these shapes and draw the pattern first i am use the shapes rectangle and square we draw the pattern easily so that's why i am using square and rectangle shapes here first use these two shapes we draw the patterns this is the square shape or rectangle we use we draw any shape so this is the square shape pattern without overlapping this pattern so first squares so these are the squares i am already draw the some lines now here we use the triangle shape here equilateral triangle equilateral triangle this is the equilateral triangle shape we use the scale and draw so these are all the triangle shapes equilateral triangle we use any shape draw it now complete eighth chapter exercise 2 this complete uh, second exercise notes pdf link on description is there if you are interested download it